I'm just gonna be showing you guys how to find your perfect sensitivity in Call of Duty. And a lot of you guys are been wondering, you know, okay, I've been aim training Newt. What sensitivity should I play at? Should it be the same sensitivity as uh, I aim train with? And you guys are uh, using, not you guys, but like everyone's in my comments are, think about it wrong. Your aim training is literally just to get mouse control, right? Um, learn the mouse control, see what you're good at, and, you know, practice from there. Work on your weaknesses, work on your um, strengths, right? So, in game, when it comes to actually learning and getting better, I highly suggest you guys load up bots, like especially if you're trying to find your new sensitivity, and all you're going to want to do is load up in shipment, try flicking around to different spots, right? Learn like where people could be at, a person could be here, a person could be here, see how I can perfectly flick. So. I can flick here, flick here, flick here, and flick over here if I need to. And what you want to do is you want to try to under flick, not over flick. That's a big thing. So when you're trying to come out with your sensitivity, if you're over flicking a target, like if I was trying to over flick that target right there, run, slide, and then just try to flick on a target. And see how much you flick, right? Like how much you over flick or under flick. In general, it's better to under flick than it is to over flick. The reason why is because I'm going to show you guys with the mouse here. When you over flick, you have to come back. So you have to stop your momentum and then bring it back. You do not want to do that. You want to under flick and then uh, slightly readjust. So under flick, slightly readjust. You always want to like under flick before you even uh, over flick. So you can go with the motion. You don't have to go against it. So what I would suggest, stand still and try to flick onto a bot. So stand still. So there's a bot over there. Flick on the bot. How did you do? Stand still, flick on the bot, flick on the spot. How did you do, right? That's what I want you guys to do. Uh, you don't even have to use this loadout. Uh, let me see, let me go edit. Let's use an assault rifle, one that I already have leveled up. Uh, K-Bam, there we go. Let's try this one out. Stay still. I don't see anybody. See how I under flick there? Stay still. Flick perfect. Flicked right onto the target. So that's how I already know that like, I am on uh, already the sensitivity that I want. And I know a lot of you guys are wondering, Newt, what sensitivity are you playing on? So I'll show you guys. And you are probably going to be like, oh, you can't play on that low of a sensitivity. Well, I am. Um, it's not that hard for me, uh, especially if uh, I want to be super accurate. So the sensitivity that I'm on as I'm going to try to kill this bot. is 2.7 minor coefficients 1.33 and i'm actually going to change that to 1.78 just because i want to have like a closer sensitivity to my ads and again monitor coefficient is all you how are you with your mouse control we're not trying to be fancy here we're trying to be practical gamers right you don't need to flick and hit every shot it's not practical what you should be doing is trying to Line up on target and stay in on target. Flicks are nice, but we want to be on target. <coughs> so yeah, guys, that's it. It's a kind of a short video. Um, just go into a firing range. Are you over flicking or under flicking? If you're over flicking, lower your sensitivity. If you're under flicking, raise your sensitivity. It's that simple. There's nothing magic to it. Um, move around. See how you move with your sensitivity. See how it is when you're like trying to like shoot people. Can you stay on target? Is it hard to stay on target? Or is it easy to stay on target? That's it. That's all it takes. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. There really is no secret. Uh, try to do a little movement. Like how you're actually going to play.
You guys can see how my arm's moving. Pretty simple and easy. So, always guys, I say bless, stay humble. I'll catch you in another video. Peace.